Jeffrey Gamer is not responsible for your game files. All mods in this tutorial have been tested and work properly. I strongly advise you back up your files as shown in this video in case you make any mistakes. I advise you watch the full video before installing any mods. Thanks. What is going on, amazing, beautiful people? Your boy Jeffrey Gamer is back at you with another LSPDFR tutorial. And today, guys and gals, it's going to be a siren install. Uh, this is a siren install that I've done. Uh, it was over a year ago, uh, but I get it. New people join the channel. Those videos get lost in the collection. So we're going to redo it. I get a lot of questions asking, what siren pack do I use? I want that siren pack. This is the one that I use in my single player. It is also 5M ready. So let's get into it, folks. We're going to be installing the Wayland Epsilon. All right. With that being said, click the link down below. That says Wayland Epsilon Siren. It's going to be right here. Baker X Goody, who makes amazing uh, sirens. Um, big shout out to him or her, you know, whatever. Um, so very simple. You can uh, preview it right here. But of course, we're going to go into the game and, tr and try it out as well and, and showcase it. So click download this file. And it's that simple. And it's going to start downloading for you. Should download fairly quick. Okay, well, a little, a little quick. It's going. Come on, fella. Alrighty, and there we go. All right, so I'm going to minimize my web browser, and we got our WinRAR right here, folks. Okay, so now that we have our Wayland Epsilon 3.0 install uh, downloaded, uh, we do have two different ways we can do. Th there's two. It, it is 5M ready, so we're going to do the 5M version now first. Then we'll do the single player. I'll show you both ways to do it. Um, so first, let's do the 5M. Bring up your file explorer. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go to your uh, whatever GTA file you use for your 5M. Um, so you're going to go to your disk drive. This is for Steam users. Go to your disk drive that your Steam games are installed through. Program files times 86. Steam. Steam apps. And common. All right, your GTA folder is going to be right there. Hold tight. Let me go to mine. Here's mine. Now. This is my 5M one. If I double click this, there's no mods in here, aside from a siren and a weapon pack, right? Um, and obviously these are my, you know, these are my uh, my LSPDFR files that have all sorts of things. So you're gonna go into the folder that you use for 5M. So if I double click my SLRP folder, this is where you wanna be. You're gonna double click time 64, audio, okay? SFX. Boom. There's our resident that RPF right there. Over here in the Wayland Epsilon WinRAR, you're going to double click the 5M folder here. And you're going to take this resident that RPF, drag it right here, and drop it in. All right. I'm not going to do that because the siren I have in my 5M is different. So once you drop it in, it's going to ask you if you want to overwrite it. Click yes. And that's it. The siren is installed in your. 5m okay so let's exit out of our file explorer let's click back in our window now let's install this into single player first thing you want to do on your desktop right click select new folder and just name it like og siren oh wait i already have one from the uh we'll do og siren 2 okay so we're going to put that up there all right, we're back here in our WinRAR. Um, now what we wanna do is go back just one more time in the WinRAR. You see that Wayland Epsilon folder right there? Take that folder, drag it to your desktop and drop it. All right, it's gonna copy it to the desktop. We can get rid of the WinRAR now. All right, so we have OG folder in the Wayland Epsilon folder. Let's go fire up our open IV. Click Windows and let it load up. Okay, while that's loading up, I'm gonna grab my little handy dandy notebook here that has my pathway for sirens, which is not there. Okay, so I have it saved in my favorites. So if I go to favorites and then I go to sirens, here's the pathway. Now, I think that you can install this single player the same way, but you know, this is just how I do it. This is just both ways to do it. So, um, as you can see, it's the same pathway as uh, as we did for the 5M. Um, so, 
you can do mods, time 64, audio, SFX. There's our resident.rpf right there. Double click it. All right, it's going to bring you right in here. Now, one thing we can do is what we want to do is go to the vehicles.awc, right click, and export to open formats. Click that. It's going to bring up your file explorer. Click desktop, and we want to look for the OG Siren. Scroll down. Actually, I'm going to look for OG Siren 2. You're going to look for whatever you named it. Okay, if I click OG Siren 2 and then select folder, it's going to take this and frip, shoot it right up in there. So now my original Siren is right here. So if you if you don't like the Wayland Epsilon, you're going to follow the same step, but you're going to install your original, your original one. So we got that saved. We can drag it over to other monitor. Good to go. Now, down here, you want to just left click to deselect that, right click and select import open formats again it's going to bring up this you're going to click desktop now you're going to look for the wayland epsilon 3.0 it's all alphabetized there it is wayland epsilon 3.0 click double click it and you want the vehicles oac just select that once click open it'll bring this up right here just simply click ok boom that's it it's installed so we can right click this delete that we can exit out of our open IV and folks, let's fire up the game and let's showcase this siren. I'll see y'all in there. All right, folks, here we are in the game and real quick, we're just gonna go in and we're gonna cycle through the sirens here and we're gonna flip our lights on. This is a non-graphic mod. That's why my, there's no graphics in this game. That's why the lights look so bad, but we're here for the sirens. So here we go. So stage three activated and we're gonna put on the, uh, the, the first stage of the siren. There's the Yelper, Welper. I don't know what the hell they're called. And then you got that one. And then you got the fourth one, the fourth cone, which is kind of like the first one, but it kind of elongates it. You hear that? How it just. And my favorite part of this is the bullhorn. Like. That is my favorite part of the siren, is that loud bullhorn. Right? So, that is it, ladies and gentlemen. That is the Wayland Epsilon siren installed into your single player or your 5M. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're new here and you feel I deserved it, please consider supporting the channel by hitting that subscribe button and ringing that bell so you know when new content is added. Also, consider giving this video a thumbs up. The more thumbs up this video gets, the more people it can reach and teach, just like it did with you. Till next time, everybody, be safe, be healthy, be positive. Follow the rules and obey the law. Your boy, Jeffrey Gamer, is out. See you on the next one. Later, y'all.